Uh, in the meantime, we're also following breaking news out of uh, our capital city today, Hartford, where a teen is in custody after a stabbing a student outside of Hartford High School this afternoon. A media briefing on the incident just wrapped up moments ago, and that's where we find Fox 61's DeAndrea Turner. So, DeAndrea, what are you learning from that media briefing? Well, the media briefing here was here at Hartford Public Schools with the superintendent, but let's rewind to tell you how we got here today. This incident happened just before noon with two students. It was isolated when an argument started inside the building and it escalated to outside the building when the suspect allegedly stabbed the victim. But here's some of the things that we are learning that's new from this press conference today. We were told that an officer that the suspect was 17 years old and he hopped in the car and tried to leave after the alleged stabbing. And we learned that because someone in the neighborhood told an officer that officers were then able to stop him and and the people who were driving the car. We also know the victim an 18 year old student is in stable condition after owing undergoing surgery. What caused this fight is still in question and they are still searching for the knife. But the superintendent is honing in that this was an isolated incident and they are making sure that all students are safe. We want to have these um, conversations that for some might be uncomfortable, but you know we know that it's important for us to provide the spaces the adults, the caring relationships for our students to feel safe, connected, valued, and that there are supports in place for them. And Hartford Public Schools will be providing on-site counseling for students, staff, and family members. And also additional school security officers will be deployed and will be maintained in increased presence at Hartford High School. For now, here in Hartford, DeAndrea Turner, Fox 61 News.